Actress Frances Barber is back on our screens this Christmas Eve for the BBC Two drama, The Metzodent, A Ghost Story for Christmas. Meet the actress that has been a reputed actress for over three decades. 2. Actress Frances Barber is back on our screens for the BBC Two drama The Mezzotint Credit, Alami. Who is Frances Barber? Frances Barber is a 63-year-old English actress. Barber was born in Wolverhampton, Staffordshire, England. She studied drama at the University College of North Wales, where she met contemporary director Danny Boyle, who became her boyfriend. She has received Olivier Award nominations for her work in the plays such as Camille, 1985, and Uncle Vanya, 1997. Her film appearances include three collaborations with Gary Oldman in Prick Up Your Ears, 1987, We Think the World of You, 1988, and Dead Fish, 2005, as well as Sammy and Rosie Get Laid, 1987, Soft Top Hard Shoulder, 1992, and Film Stars Don't Die in Liverpool, 2017. Her television credits include The Street, 2009, Doctor Who, 2011, and Silk, 2012-2014. 2. Frances Barber has spent over three decades being an actress. Is she married? No. Baber is not married. The actress has not disclosed the reason behind why she hasn't chosen a husband. However, Frances has had a few relationships with partners whom she met during her work. Her first boyfriend was Danny Boyle, director of Slumdog Millionaire, with whom she worked during her high school. The actress was also in a lovely relationship with Drop the Donkey actor Neil Pearson. They dated for five years and finally got separated in 1990. Her last known relationship was with her co-star in King Lear, Sir Ian McKellen. They were in a relationship until 2008. She fondly remembers and adores him for the support he gave when she met a bike accident in 2007, which wrecked her knee. Three years ago, Frances opened up in an interview with The Times about being single and turning 60. I'd been fine with 40, fine with 50, but with 60 I just wanted to pretend it hadn't happened, she said. Seeing that six as the first digit, I really didn't like it. It felt so old. But then I saw Nigella Lawson talking about turning 60 and how you had to embrace it, and I thought, she's right. It is a new chapter, and 60 is supposed to be the new 40. Women have been given an extension. We were brought up to think that by this age it would be all over, but it doesn't feel like that anymore. It's not as awful as I thought it was going to be. What is her net worth? Barbara has an estimated net worth of $56 million, according to MarryBiography.com. She has earned that sum of money mainly through her acting career. She won the Dagger Award in the category of Best Supporting Actress for Silk in 2012 and won Best Actress for Trick or Treat in 2019.